So as you can see, I've put them in, and I'm going to mix it up into the uh, mix it up into the seeds. How to add fruit to your budgies diet? If you're interested in your budgies diet, then hopefully, like me, you believe that supplying a varied diet plan for your budgie or indeed any pet bird is our number one responsibility. At the end of the day we are keeping and taming wild creatures in a cage, and so to some extent these lovely creatures are living at our mercy, so it is imperative and essential that we do, at the very least, provide all that which they require to keep their health, both mental and physical and thus their comfort and happiness to the best of our ability. The biggest issue is not with the seeds themselves. They are a fundamental part of a wild bird's diet plan, but not the only component by far, as in the wild the birds will have evolved to eat a varied diet from the fruit and vegetables in their territory, and so seed alone does not accomplish the nutritional needs of any bird, wild or otherwise. Birds with seed-only diets will certainly succumb to the many illnesses that come from vitamin shortage leading to inadequate stamina and power, a physical health system that does not preserve itself correctly leading to bad body immune system features, and its life expectancy might be shortened. In the wild parrots and budgies eat a lot of the exact same food items as we humans do, with the exemption possibly of meat. The truth is, we actually do not recognize what exactly a wild bird eats in its indigenous environment. Bird science has established what their bodies require and a captive diet is based upon this expertise. Thus life in captivity may not offer the important things that they would choose to eat in the wild, so naturally we do the best we can to supply the best adequate alternatives as possible with what is available in our pet shops and so it's important to find a pet shop that specializes in many types of seed, fruit and treats. Your pet shop should have more than just one type of seed as it's important to have a mixture especially if your bird is young, just like human babies they need to eat food that is easy for them to eat. You will find your bird is hungriest in the early morning, and so it is best to capitalize on this moment of the day to present new foods. Begin a routine for your budgie, as soon as you begin to wake your bird up every early morning, and so it ought to receive a bowl of food that consists of carefully mixed fruits and seeds with the very first 50% of her seed mixed in and sprayed noticeably over the top. Whatever you choose to offer fruit is best, and also you ought to alter this regularly to keep a varied diet. Just like human babies they have a need for routine and consistency that causes your bird to dig around in its food to find the seed as well as inevitably much of the fruit that will certainly be stuck to the seed as well as on the beak which serves as a forerunner to in fact eating it. If your bird is hesitant to explore and check this out, mix in even more seed to begin. At this time you can also present pellets however it is less complicated to get a bird onto fresh foods first and afterwards present the pellets into the mix later. However you won't recognize this until you give it a try and look to see what your bird does. Later in the afternoon you can top up the bowl with seed alone. Good luck varying your budgie's diet. Now you just have to wait and watch. It is also a good idea to hang a piece of fruit in the cage to get them used to seeing it and they will be intrigued eventually to start pecking at it. Wait and watch. Thanks for watching and I hope that you will feel free to ask questions. Okay, so... Here I have a little bowl with some seed in it, which is what they normally eat. Now I want to introduce an apple which I've got from the fruit and I've washed it, make sure there's no pesticides on it. So I'm just going to cut the apple up. Okay, so I've just um, cut off a few slices and now I'm going to chop them up into little tiny pieces. So I finally chopped up the apple into some really tiny little tiny cubes so as you can see i've put them in and i'm going to mix it up into the uh mix it up into the seeds okay so there's my seeds and now i'm just going to sprinkle on top some uh budgie seed and that should do them put that back in the cage so there it is it's back in the cage all we've got to do is wait and see what they do and how they respond to it 